Well, isn't that guy small? Settlers Creek is doing another competition. And this time it's for Rosie, but we're not going small like we did last week with the whitetail. We're going big. And, well, this guy just isn't going to do it. Currently, we're sitting 19th. And that's pretty good. We did pretty good over the weekend. Um, th we're 700 something was our score combined with weight. And 841 is what we need to beat. So we need about like a 380 score in elk. That's max weight. But we can take this guy with a really bad shot. That was a terrible shot. Well, he kind of got stuck there which works. Maybe he'll stay there? Nope, there he goes. Darn, should put another arrow in him. But that's okay. Hopefully we'll find something big today, but you never know. We, Like I said, we had good luck. I got a good size elk. He was like a 332, 450-ish weight in kilograms. So he's definitely up there, but just not high enough to get us into the top 10. My goal is to get top 10. That's what we're shooting for today, but it kind of just depends on what's on the map. Like this is RNG and patience because there's usually something good on the map. We just have to find it. Well, this turned into a pretty interesting track. This guy kind of fled in weird directions all over the place. But check him out, nice and small. If we're going for the smallest, we might be top 10 with this guy, but that's not what we're going for. We got him with lung and intestine shot. Just a bad shot all over. 64 on score. Now, the requirements are lung hit or heart hit. Has to be one or the other. Has to at least hit one lung. Use You can use whatever weapon you want. So we're using just the normal. We have the snake bite compound and then the 30R over and under. They're just they're the most capable. The snake bites quiet. The 30 yards can take just about everything on this map except for bobcat and turkey. So that's what the compound's for. If we can get in close on those, we'll take them with that. And game plan is pretty simple. We started up here at the northern outpost. Guy came down here and I called because I'm usually able to get one out of here. And that's exactly where he came from. He came from right there where my waypoint is, came up. So now we're just going to work, work our way over from here to our little bit of a tree stand there then we'll work our way down and over into this tree stand and then we might fast travel back hit this one and this one and that usually gets me some good good animals it kind of just depends on the spawn of this map after opening it up but usually i can get some good animals especially rosies that way hopefully that's what we can do today. I really would like to get like a 380 rosy. I've never gotten above 330s. So maybe today's the day. No, there's another bull. And this is going to be a little interesting. We've actually got two. We've gotten two bugles. So we got to be safe here. I started out up there on that little hill there. But I just didn't like my positioning. So I low crawled over here. That guy's not bad. It's definitely bigger than the last one. Curious, there's the other one. Oh, that's a cow. There's the other one there. About the same size. I wonder what his weight is. Either way, we want to get them to kind of come over here. I don't want to move too much, but I definitely want to reposition a little bit. I think we can get this guy first if he just keeps coming. The other one's going to be a little bit tougher. This guy's coming in. He's at about 30. I can get him to stop. Ah, oh, we... Oh, we did get a drop. Drop. Okay. Ooh. I need that bull. I might pull out the 30R and get him. This cow is going to mess me up. Or we drop shot the cow. Good, good, we're good there. Perfect, this is working out perfect. Now we can drop shot this guy. I think he's on to us. He's a little bit high, but I think we're good. I think we're good. That's three right there. Woo. 
They came in quick, too. I like it when it works out like that. The cow we don't care about. Good, just arrow all the way through. And then this, I think they're about the same. Both about the same. I didn't get the weight estimate on that guy, but this one, 416.8, 220 score. So not going to help us any, but it does help us with some objectives. Then this guy, probably about the same, honestly. See, and I'm up close. Is it, oh, he's got... There's another one coming. It's a cow. Just in case she's got a bull with her that I didn't know about. I'm gonna put her down. Oh, oh. Okay. Maybe this guy had a little sticker on him, so he's probably gonna hurt her score. 381 weight, 175 score. Yeah, that's sticker. I messed his score up a little bit. And... That might have been all of them. I'm not sure. Nope, there's another cow. Jeez, man. How many are there? I'm worried there's another bull in this herd that I don't know about. And if there is, I've got to take them, but... I hate wasting arrows on these. I just hate wasting the arrows on them, but... If there's a bull in here... We gotta know. I don't think there's any more. I think that's gonna be all of them. Yeah, I think we're good. We're gonna keep working our way to the tree stand. I just kind of let out a bugle every now and then to see if we can get one to pop off. Kind of like I do when I'm actually hunting, just locator bugles, see if you can get one to bugle back at you. And when they bugle back, I set up quick and take them down. Of course, there's a turkey, too. I'm not too worried about the turkeys today. If we hear a gobble, I might take after, take out after the gobble. But I'm not too worried about calling them in today. Oh my gosh, we got a bear coming in. Thought I heard one. I just didn't see him. We also have a buck coming in, too. Ah, oh, this guy's not going to give me a shot, though, is he? Could use the 30R. I can go for this shot. I can go for that one. Easy. And then our buck's still coming in. This one would have been a great one for last week. And we're trying to get a small buck. He's out there somewhere, slowly coming in. But he's pretty small. But that bear just kind of came out of nowhere. I don't even know what that bear was. There's our buck. See him? Super tiny, super, super, super small. Let's get our spying scope out so you guys can see him a little better. Look at that. He's tiny. Not as small as the one we got last week, but he is, he is pretty small. And over the weekend when I was playing, I got one that would have gotten us in top 10 if we were still in the challenge. Unfortunately, the challenge was over at that point, but he scored... I want to say like 35, 33 would have been a perfect one. Would have been absolutely perfect. But unfortunately, we weren't in the challenge anymore. Now, there's been no luck with Rosies here other than some cows. As you can see, we've got some down right there. But we have the bear and the buck coming in. We'll pick them up and the cows once we get this buck down. And hopefully be able to get a bull to come in. Slowly but surely, this buck's coming in. I just about have a shot. We can get him to get past that tree. We'll have a shot. There he is. Oof. 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 That was a little far back. That was a bad shot. It's all right. We'll be able to track him down. Probably liver, intestines, something like that. Let's grab this bear, and then we'll track him down. I won't show you guys the cows, because cows are boring. What's not boring is a big black bear. So hopefully this guy's big. That was a great shot. Chocolate. Oh, that's awesome. I didn't realize he looked black. That did not look like a chocolate bear. 18.5547. And chocolate's not rare. Apparently there's no rare fur variations from what I read for black bear. It's, there's black, which is the common 
and then all the other ones are just variations none of them rare so i think i'm just gonna get trophy shot because i haven't seen chocolate he doesn't look chocolate that is not a chocolate bear i mean maybe i'm crazy but that is not chocolate not chocolate at all so I don't know what that's going on about, but I mean, I guess if they want to say it's chocolate, we'll say it's chocolate. Just a little funny photo. I mean, yeah, I don't think that's chocolate, but oh, that's a bugle though. That we care about. That we care about. It's a ways away. It's down here by the road. Um... Well, I guess we get back into our tree stand instead of tracking down that deer and kill ourselves a bugle. There's our bugler and he's max weight estimate, but small rack. So that's unfortunate. We'll still take him with the bow just to be safe. But fortunately, I don't think he's gonna move us up. Well, I know he's not gonna move us up. That's maybe a 200 rack. If we're lucky. So that's unfortunate. And here he comes right over the hill. Should be a pretty easy shot if we can. Get it in the right spot. Yeah. Easy enough. Drop him where he stands. We have a doe that just bleated at us, but I'm not too concerned with her. There's a chance she could have a buck with her, but usually they don't come in with bucks over here, so I'm not not too worried about it. And here's our bull. Let's see. He looks looks good. No, no stickers on that one at least. Can't really see this one. Eh, yeah, no stickers that I can tell. Let's pick him up, see what he scored. 446. Good weight. We just need that 380. I keep getting really good weighing ones. I need a 380. But just not quite getting it. Hopefully we'll get it. This is Flinter says if not getting big ones off the rip you'll eventually find one if you just stick to it so I'll trust the guy that's been at this a lot longer than I have been and our buck that we shot let's see what we just body mm, that's that hurts that's our that's our doe she's coming in but I think we're just gonna track this guy down see if we can't find his dead body should go down with a body hit from the bow now, well here's our buck we did find him and we can wow we could really see the arrow we like just went into the skin I'm surprised he went down with that shot it was a really bad shot a 53.85 definitely a small one not the smallest I've gotten but definitely a small one Got a buck coming in. I can't see him though. He's like right above me. Where is he? There he is. Right, I can't see a good shot. I think that was a good shot. Yeah, it was. Okay, he went down. Ooh, got a black bear. He's kind of roaring. He's right over there. And let's see if we can't put a spot and stock on him. I don't know if we will. Let's see. Well, how big was this guy? I didn't even really pay attention. Oh, he's not big at all. He's a little baby. Oh, we got him in the neck. We shot a little high. 71 kilos. Another 50 score. 54.3. Bad shot, but... He went down right away, so that's good. I'm not able to get eyes on this bear, but I do have a buck coming in. He grunted at me. I grunted back. I'm just kind of slowly making my way to the top of this mountain, or top of this hill here, so I can look down where he's coming from. Hopefully without spooking him. I don't know how fast he's coming in. If he's coming in fast, I'm screwed. He's close. He's real close.
He's like right on the other side of that thicket there. There he is. Oh, he's not a bad looking one either. He's got some good mass to him. A couple of stickers. Max weight estimate. It's not bad. 40. I can make that shot as long as he doesn't move. If he's moving, I can't make that shot. Yeah, he's moving. We'll just let him get in a little bit closer. He's decent. He's not He's not my best. I got one the other day. I believe he's like a 8x7. Oh, shoot. He's alert. I need to take this shot. Oh, I shot right over. Oh. Oh, my gosh. I just got so lucky with that shot. Holy cow. That was the luckiest shot I've ever made. I think I spined him. Wow. I don't know how that hit. Wow. I was totally distracted talking about the one that I just killed the other day. He was like an 8x7, so like a 14, 15 point, something like that. He was pretty big, but he didn't score that high, which was, was interesting. But yeah, this guy's got a couple little stickers on him. Good mass. The stickers are going to hurt him, though. Let's see. What do you score? 92.5 got me the liver and the spine 154 that i think my biggest was 168 i want to say something like that but let's just i want to pick him up so we can see those stickers real well because uh, i think he's got some on the other side too it, let's see here yeah he's got one there oh he's got a few on this side yeah those hurt his score hurt his score bad but that's one two three four five six seven by seven i think one two three four five six seven yeah so 14 point just those stickers those stickers really messed them up that's that's just unfortunate whoa yeah he's got he's got stickers everywhere on this thing everywhere neat looking one though definitely a good looking good looking buck um Trying to get his head turned up so we can see a better look at him. Yeah, this is real similar to the one that I killed the other day. But just he just didn't have all that junk going on. Which, I mean, personally, I like all the junk. But it hurts his score. So, oh well. Good mature buck. He's down. He is down. Now I'm curious where this bear went. But I think he's probably gone by now. And we need to stay focused on Rosie, so we're going to let him go and get over to this little outpost or stand. Hopefully be able to get a Rosie in over there. I know I said I was going to focus on Rosies. I'm having a really hard time finding bulls, but look at that. Holy cow, that dude's nice. Kind of like our last one we took. He doesn't have all the junk going on. He doesn't have stickers or anything. So he should be probably a 160s, I think. If we're lucky. We do have some cows coming in too, though. And I'm worried that they might have a bull with them. Hopefully our buck gets here before they do. Then if they have a bull, we can take the bull. It's going to be tough. Don't know why I'm having such a hard time finding bulls today, but that's how it goes. Set up to record. Can't find any bulls. This guy is really nice. He doesn't have as many points. He is nice. Oh, crit. I think he's catching on to us. Just something else walking around I can hear. Okay, he's getting in close enough. We can take this shot. Hopefully without spooking the bear. Bear went alert. Something else down there. There's our elk. There is a bull with them. Really small. Really struggling to get him to come in though. They are just totally zoned in on something else there we go they turned okay so there is a bull at least we can get that 
And we can get this bear. Female black bear. Nothing special about her, but we can get her down. I have to hold a little high on this shot. Oh, crud. Well, that just messed us up. Let's gonna topple over right there. No. Crud. Shouldn't have rushed that shot. So we might have just spooked off. No. Maybe not. They're still coming. Okay. That works out. That works out. Woo. Thought we spooked off our elk. That was just disastrous. We got our blood here. I'm going to see what it says we hit. We should have. Yeah, we vitaled. That's back in that lung heart. I don't know. But here's our big white tail. Let's see. What do you score? 93 kilos. 157. Thought he was going to be a 160s, but fortunately he's not. We'll just leave him be. And then the one last one we kind of need to check blood on is our black bear. Doesn't say what I hit. Just roaming. I, I, I'm i guessing. Looks like body. Well, he's no giant, but we finally have a bull. And this has turned into quite the hunt. I think just for s sakes of getting him down, we're gonna get him in the lung at least, I hope. I hope that was a lung hit. Let's see if we see him go somewhere. I think he went down over there. I think he went down right there. Shouldn't have gone far. Use the rifle just because this has been quite a hunt. I even had backed out, did some other things, came back a few hours later, and I've put in another two and a half hours trying to find a good one. And best we got so far is a 220. So, yeah, we've gotten docked down to 20th in the rank, which isn't good, but, um, might be able to put some more time in later in the week and hopefully get ourselves top 10. Let's see, where's this bull at? Right here, yeah, he did topple over right where I thought. And he's not gonna score well, not very many points on him. 378 weight, 182 on the score. Holy cow, I'm gonna call it there. This has been quite the challenge. Usually it's not so hard to find some rosies, but now it turned into challenging. So if you like this kind of content, be sure you hit the like and subscribe button. Of course, share the video with a friend. And then, of course, thank you to my members. You guys are awesome. Really do appreciate you. If you want to become a member, check the link down in the description below. You'll find that link. You can see all the perks, the three different tiers we have, all that good stuff. Or check out the merch. We will be doing some new merch here eventually. And last but not least, go enjoy your good home with a good friend. I'll catch you in the next one.